S of n is the sum from 1 to n of k over k plus 1 factorial. Find 1 minus S of 2022 over 1 minus S of 2023. How can we solve this complex summation problem? To start off, let's look at a few small values of S, see if we'll maybe find a pattern. S of 1 is 1 over 2 factorial, which is half. S of 2 is 1 over 2 factorial plus 2 over 3 factorial, which is half or 3 6 plus 2 6, which is 5 over 6. S of 3 is 1 over 2 factorial plus 2 over 3 factorial plus 3 over 4 factorial. And this is 1, one over 2 factorial is 12 over 24. 2 over 3 factorial, which is 2, 6, is 8 over 24. And 3 over 4 factorial is just 3 over 24. The sum, 23 by 24. Do you notice a pattern here? Hmm. Notice that half is just 1 minus 1 half. 5, 6 is 1 minus 1, 6. And 23 over 24 is 1 minus 1 over 24. Notice that 1 minus 1 half is the same as 1 minus 1 over 2 factorial. 1 minus 1 6 is the same as 1 minus 1 over 3 factorial. And 1 minus 1 over 24 is just 1 minus 1 over 4 factorial. Hmm. So it seems like we found a pattern here. S of 1, 1 minus 2, 1 over 2 factorial. S of 2, 1 minus 1 over 3 factorial. So in general, we would like to see, we would like to try and prove that if our pattern holds true, S of n is 1 minus 1 over n plus 1 factorial. And if we can prove this is true, then our pattern holds. Okay, so how can we do this? Notice that this is equal to this term in the summation, k over k plus 1 factorial, is nothing but k plus 1 over k plus 1 factorial minus 1 over k plus 1 factorial. Isn't that cool? It's almost, and we can cancel out k plus 1 from the top and the bottom, and this gives us 1 over k factorial, because k plus 1 factorial is k plus 1 times k factorial. And all in all, we get this. Okay, so now can we try and prove this statement? And to do that, all we have to do is write s of n. Okay, so when k is 1, this is going to be 1 over 1 factorial minus 1 over 2 factorial. When k is 2, this is 1 over 2 factorial minus 1 over 3 factorial. When k is 3, this is 1 plus 3 factorial minus 1 over 4 factorial. Dot 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 all the way until when k is n minus 1, this is 1 over n minus 1 factorial minus 1 over n factorial. And when k is n, this is plus 1 over n factorial minus 1 over n plus 1 factorial. Notice that everything cancels out. This cancels with this term. This cancels with this term. This cancels with this term. So on, all the way until these two terms cancel. And what are we left with? We are just left with 1 minus 1 over n plus 1 factorial. So now all we have to do is plug in our formula that we came up with here into this. And this we can do pretty easily. This is just 1 minus s of 2022. Well, that's just going to be 1 over 2023 factorial over 1 minus 1 over 2024 factorial. 1 minus this, because uh, this is s of 2022, 
and similarly one minus this over here. So notice that this is just going to be equal to 1 over 20, 23 factorial over 1 over 20, 24 factorial, which simplifies to 20, 24 factorial over 20, 23 factorial. And since 20, 24 factorial is just 20, 24 times 20, 23 factorial, this is just 20, 24. Yay, we did it. Thanks for watching.